It's colorful and eye-catching. You know, all they see is pretty candy. But it's not what it seems. Law enforcement calls it rainbow fentanyl, and it's contributing to the deadly opioid epidemic. It's a death sentence. Give your kids a bag of Skittles, give them M&Ms, give them whatever they want to keep them from thinking that they need to go get this candy somewhere else. Tuesday, the DEA put out a warning against the drug, asking people to be on the lookout as it is targeted towards minors. It's just ridiculous. I don't understand why um, drug people would target young people. Christy Fox's son, Treston, passed away after overdosing from the deadly fentanyl drug in October of 2021. The loss devastating for her and his loved ones. It's been hard since October and that's, you know, you just, after something like that, you just walk through. Now she's using her voice to speak out, being an advocate for others who experienced a loss and educating. Although it may be colorful and eye-catching, it's deadly. And mothers like Christy are bringing awareness to that in our very own community. You don't know what is in that. You don't know how much is in that. The people that are making it can't even tell you how much is in that because it's not distributed evenly. In a statement from a DEA administrator, rainbow fentanyl, fentanyl pills and powder that come in a variety of bright colors, shapes and sizes is a deliberate effort by drug traffickers to drive addiction amongst kids and young adults. In an effort to stop this, the DEA is warning parents and young adults. As just last year alone, more than 107,000 overdose deaths were reported in the U.S., 71,000 of those from synthetic opioids. One time is, can be too many. The first time can be too much. They're urging people to be alert and aware of this new version of the drug. Reporting in Evansville, Sydney Spencer, 44 News.